blown away by how inexpensive, relatively, a large TV is compared to what it was when these things first came out. Yeah, when I bought one. Yeah, yeah that's right. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh, they're a dollar now. Great. They're, <laughs> they're basically ah. just giving them away. <laughs> yeah, those Black Friday deals, they get better every year. And I always buy them the year before when it's still expensive. So this morning, we have some low clouds mixing in and some high clouds up above. So this is such a cool shot. Looking towards La Jolla from Mount Soledad, you can see the low clouds down below and the high clouds up above. This is what it looks like in El Cajon. Just kind of some high, thin, cirrus clouds out there. But we're going to see those mixing in through the day today should actually add some color to our sunrise and sunset not only today but tomorrow as well so get those cameras ready temperatures in the 50s and 40s all across the county except for in warner springs on our maps at least it's 38 degrees there and we have this little weak high pressure system that's going to be building over the weekend it's going to nudge our temperatures up a bit on sunday and usher in very weak santa Ana flow but you can see those clouds that are already streaming in from the west of us from the southwest of us those will be with us today and tomorrow but those offshore winds on sunday will have to push those clouds offshore once again. So by Sunday, we'll see a lot more sunshine. Temperatures trending near to about five degrees above normal for the coast and inland neighborhoods. But get this, the mountain areas are close to 15 degrees above normal, and the desert area is still about five to 10 degrees above normal. Fair weather sticks around into Thanksgiving week. We're generally going to be in the 60s over the next seven days along our coast, though Sunday, again, with those offshore winds, temperatures bump up into the 70s. Inland neighborhoods generally in the mid-70s. By Sunday, I think we're going to see some upper 70s and maybe a couple of 80s, but mostly staying in the 70s. And then low 70s next week, down to a 70 exactly on Thanksgiving, in fact. For the mountain areas, highs will remain in the mid-60s with calmer winds the next couple of days. And then the foothill and mountain areas will get a bit breezy Sunday into Monday. Could see a couple of gusts up to 30 miles per hour in the wind-prone areas, but it's going to be a very localized week event as far as those winds go. Desert areas in the 80s through the weekend with 70s into next week, about 75 for Thanksgiving.